hey i'm sabrina i make videos about showering which can give your youngins odd visuals this is my career nice to meet you let's be friends salutations so if you couldn't have figured it out already by the title of this video this is going to be things i hate about showering which hopefully you guys can find relatable to and things you might also hate so without further ado let's jump right in Okay, number one. So we all know that you have to wait for the water to, like, you know, heat up and stuff and get warm for you to enter. So you're standing there, like, you feel like you're in Alaska in your bathing suit. You're freezing. But not only does this happen one time, it happens three. Well, probably. Alright, so it's that. And say you forgot something outside, like a towel or a wash rag. I call it rag, whatever. You have to go back out into the cold, and you can't wait to get back in. And then when you get out, you race for that towel to get wrapped around your robe or whatever, because you know you're about to freeze to death. Number two. So when you're in the shower and you have, you know, shampoo, conditioner, bywash, whatever you have on you, and you're trying to get it off from your face or whatever, and you have to close your eyes, right? So you get paranoid that while you aren't able to see your surroundings because, you know, your face is covered in water, that there's a murderer out there who already killed your family and now he's coming for you. Is that just me? No, it can't because I saw it on a Facebook post. hey -o. Number three, the soap. This has to happen at least once in someone's life, where you have the soap in your hands, and since you have the water on you, it's all slippery, and you're like, oh, no, no, and then it drops, and then you have to try to get in the drain, and by the time you already get it, it's all melted, and then you drop it a couple times, and it's so chaotic, and you feel like you're just, Ugh. moving on. Next is when you come out of the shower, and you know that glass or whatever you have that you have to go like that, or the wall or whatever, and you say you bang your toe on it, and it hurts so bad that you're just like, oh my. Sorry for the inconvenience, but we are experiencing technical difficulties. Please join us back in a moment. And we're back. Okay, so the next one is going to be very visual. Get your thinking caps on. Okay, so, when you have the shampoo and it's running down your face, I don't know if I'm the only one who experiences this, but, like, do you ever, like, start to not breathe? Like, not breathe, but, like, your face is covered with shampoo, so you're afraid if you breathe, the shampoo will, like, get in your mouth, and then you're, like, just trying to figure out a way to breathe, and then you start panicking, and you, like, finally just start to look over the, um, shower, like, have it run off your face, and, like, <gasps> Haha, <laughs> just me? Okay. And last, but certainly not least, with showering, you have to pay a price. Let me first get across that you are not supposed to shower or wash your hair or whatever every day. It is bad for your skin. It can get it all oily. It's bad for your hair because it gets thinner and, you know, all that. You're not supposed to shower every day. With that, you have the people who are like clean freaks, and they're just like, Ew, you didn't shower yesterday? That's so gross. And then there's me. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I don't care. End of discussion. Okay, so guys, if you think I left out anything and there's anything else that you guys hate, be sure to leave them in the comments, and I'll be sure to reply. And... Until next time, be sure to like this video, comment, favorite, whatever, and most of all, subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, bye.